three car garage. This uh, house is solid concrete, it's concrete block. Give you a little view of the landscape here. Paper wall. Very low maintenance yard. You have a gated entry, just so you can see it. That looks out toward the intercoastal. We'll get some views from there. said very low maintenance yard the house is in flawless condition solid concrete foundation is six feet thick this thing is built like a fortress absolutely gorgeous place Entryway. Full bath right ahead of us. Upstairs. Down to the garage area right there. The bedroom. And a full bath right here. Give you a better view of the bedroom here. This one has its own little balcony. Some chairs out here. back in let's go out to the kitchen living area so there's the entryway again walk into like a dining room area kitchen these arches in here are beautiful Living room area. Really high ceilings. Windows everywhere for natural light. Ocean is right out there. I don't know if you can see it. Let me see if I can zoom in a little bit. So from here you have a view of the beach and the ocean. Fireplace. I believe it's electric.
There's a little eating area right here off of the kitchen. Here's another little room which has access to the uh, outside area. Nice little eye out there, but this is uh, another seating area. Actually, I would turn it into another bedroom. Kind of do an Airbnb. Put some curtains on the windows and just turn it into another bedroom. Side area on the first floor. There's your view. Zoom in a little bit there. Small it looks like the naked eye right there. I'll zoom it out a little bit. Get a better view. This is the neighborhood. Let's go back in. So let's go in the garage area and then we'll go upstairs. The garage area is huge also. So here's the laundry room. There's a sink. A little storage area underneath the stairs. A water heater, AC unit. In this room, technically, it could be another bedroom if we need it to be. Put some furnishings in here and uh, get heated and cooled also. I think they kind of use it as a uh, storage area, but just change out that door, make it another bedroom if need be. It's heated and cooled, nice little space. Some bug beds in that room, kids would probably love it. So, this is the first bay of the garage. You got the storage area at the end of it. So, there's the garage door. There's the first bay. You can see cement block. House is solid cement. Second bay. Another room off of this. Storage room, another storage room. This place is just endless, it seems like. Little AC units so you can control the humidity and temperature in here. Right there, too. They just use the uh, cheapo window ones, which work perfectly for this type of uh, setup. That way, you can store stuff in there. This is the third bay. Has a workbench on it. Let's go back uh, upstairs.
So let's go up where the master is. So technically it's one, one bed down, two up. But as you saw, we have some extra rooms that can make some extra bedrooms. Top of the stairs. Full bath. Walks into the master. We'll take it. We'll go around the other way. So this is a bedroom. Again, right off the top of the stairs. Little seating area. Could easily uh, throw a pull-out couch in here too. So that's a hallway, there's the stairs right there. So I guess this used to be a sauna and they just started using it as a master closet. But it worked well for that. Master bedroom. right out there Let's just take a peek in here so this is the master bath it's kind of long and narrow tile floor tub shower There's the hallway we came from right there. Little seating area. Kind of an in-between room. It looks over this. The living room. So you can be part of the conversation. There's the beach right out these windows. Here's another room right off the master. This is where you could a uh, view of the ocean. These windows all open. So you could let the ocean breeze in. Today would be a perfect day for that. It's like 80 degrees out or so. Let's give you what the real view is. That's pretty much what you see from your eye right there. Definitely ocean views and the beach access. Show up to you is right in there. If we look past the right hand side of that satellite dish as we're looking out, two people walking on it. That's the walkover for the beach. That's how close you are. And we'll take a walk over there. I'll show you how quick you can get over there. We'll just zoom back out. So this is pretty cool. I just noticed this, these beams up here in the master with the windows for more natural light. Very cool property. So solid. Right, I'm looking, I don't see any cracks anywhere. This place, uh, of 
course, like I said, they had to ask. This thing is sitting on six feet of concrete, so it's solid and not moving. Some nice construction. So this lot is pretty large. I think we'll walk over here. So we have a path. Leads us right over to the walk over, crossover. The dune crossover to get to the beach. So this is all this property, this path we're walking on, all this property belongs to this house. It's like the edge of the property line right there and somebody else owns this little sliver. They can't really build on it. It's pretty small. They could build like an 800 square foot home there. This is a very unique property. There's a beach. There's the walk over to the beach right there. We cross over the dune. How close is that? Let's take a walk back. Take in a little more of this. It's beautiful here. outside view of the house beautiful metal roof up there new paver driveway this place is gorgeous outside shower so you come back from the beach Welcome to the beach life. 